Hey guys, we're going to make our first five star today. So, um, what we're going to do is we're going to look at our monsters. Uh, we've got our Konamiya, we've got our Magic Knight, we've got our Shannon, we've got our Rakaja. They're all max four star. And then I've got my Water Fairy, this Water Bounty Hunter, and these two Rainbow Mons. So, I've got enough materials to make a five star now. Um, any one of these four I can make five star. What I'm going to do though is I'm going to make my Magic Knight five star first because uh, she is my only DPS monster. So, uh, she needs to do most of my damage for me so I can level up faster. So she's going to get five star first. Um, and then I should be also, I'm also going to probably awaken Bernard too. I mean, um, four star Bernard. So, um, like I said before, when you're getting a four star to a five star, to a five star you have to have four four stars to evolve it. So we're going to use those four four stars there uh, because everything else we're using is locked. So those are the four four stars we are going to hit evolve. All right. We get some nice lightning, and there we go. So we got our five stars. So we got evolution successful. So now, same thing. When you level up any unit, they go all the way back to one. So uh, we're gonna have to level her up a little bit before she can start doing some more levels for us. Now, so I want to talk about first time we get a five star, we just got seventy crystals, which is awesome. Next up, we get a booster, which doubles our experience, which is also really really good. We get two three star rainbow mons, which is awesome because I can use those to awaken, uh, or sorry, to four star some of my other monsters. A mystical scroll and then a four star max level Rainbow Mon. So with that four star max level Rainbow Mon, that's one piece towards making a six star. So that's great rewards come to us, gave us, and we just get those for free. So that's awesome. Uh, so we're going to take that and then we're also going to evolve Bernard. We're going to eat uh, one of these wind serpents. A Rainbow Mon. I think I have another Rainbow Mon. I do have another Rainbow Mon. So we're going to Wind Serpent, Rainbow Mon, Rainbow Mon. The reason I'm eating the Wind Serpent is is because I can farm him again. He is farmable. So uh, I'm not too, too worried about getting him again. Some of these other monsters, I don't know. I might want to keep one or two of them. So uh, the reason I ate that first Bounty Hunter is because I summoned another one. Not that I'm probably ever going to use a Water Bounty Hunter, but I've got one in case I need it. Um, so we're going to go ahead and evolve Bernard to four star. So we got our Bernard to four star. We're going to get another Rainbow Mon from the event, which is nice. Uh, this event's not really for us since we're new players. It's more for your advanced level players, so uh, we can't get too much. But we can go in and collect our rewards here. So we still have our Fire um, Angel Mon in there, which is good. But we're going to collect these guys. Now, I do have a Day Booster and 100 Energy. Now, I got that because I completed uh, Varai, I don't know how to pronounce that, Rofagus Ruins, I guess. So when you complete that, you get a booster and um, 100 energy, which is really nice. And then Famon, when we complete that, we're going to get a Light and Darkness Scroll. So we've gone all the way up to three, so we got a bunch of levels left. Um, how I'm doing these is I'm just borrowing a friend's monster. So it's just a rep monster is getting me through all of those. So what I'm going to be doing is probably, I guess, going back to normal for now and probably running two, because two is all water monsters. And we're going to use our Magic Knight, we're going to use Bernard in there, and then I'm leveling up a Pixie as well. Uh, because I'm trying to get that to a three-star max level, because as you can see right here, I've got four Yetis. Those four Yetis are going to be used to evolve um, Rockajaw, and he's going to get four skill-ups at the same time. So... As you can see, he needs three, two, and four. So he still needs quite a bit of skill ups. Uh, Shannon's the same boat. She needs a lot of skill ups. I did get lucky and got pep talk already, but I do want to get decelerate and spirit ball maxed out uh, just for the extra uh, percentages on their uh, chance. So we're probably just going to do this a couple times until my magic knight reaches about level 15, 16. Then he'll have the same stats he did at four star max level and he'll be easily able to. Uh, to do some hard modes again. So, um, as you can see, he's already doing pretty good damage. So, I just wanted to keep you guys informed what I was doing. So, got my Magic Knight. Um, I'm still farming uh, Mount White Ragon. Still looking for, I believe, two more Garudas to max out um, Konamiya skills. And then I need those Yetis. So, I have those four sitting there. So, four, and I believe, I think it's three or four. I think it's four more that I need. So, not that many more. But, um, Thought I'd let you guys know what I'm doing. As you can see, uh, her doing the normal mode, it's going to be easy mode. I still have my Shannon there to help out uh, until 
she gets max level. I could probably take Shannon out and she'd be fine. So um, that wraps it up for today, guys. Uh, if you guys like it, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys later.